Okay, hello, it is Drop Therapy using a stand made out of the newest Tool album, fucking uh, huge like uh, metal box with candy in it or something, a book, and my, my wallet as a stand. Anyway, that's what I'm using as a stand. Anyway, um, yeah, so I couldn't do the Q&A video yesterday because I, uh, it was a mix of me being both too lazy and I had stuff to do. So really it's just mainly because I had stuff to do. Or that I was too lazy. It's up to, uh, to you to determine which one of those is more accurate. Anyway, I have all of my because I can't look at um, the video on, um, or I can't record. I can't like film the video while uh, looking at the comments. So I have them written on this piece of paper, which happens to be this weird. English assignment I wrote in fifth grade, which I don't know why it's printed. It's literally just about a Minecraft world um, that I made when I was 11. Anyway, I have these on here. I'm going to start now. Sequence says transgender. I should add that he um, doesn't either doesn't know how to spell sequence or left the E out for stylistic purposes, which that's a weird stylistic decision, but uh, if it catches on, it catches on. Uh, he also says Mark. Actually, it's Madison. Um, the, then Me Too, which... If you can read this, I don't know, it's probably in reverse, but like... Just literally Me Too. Alright. Mechanical Birds says that apparently uh, they used to follow me on DeviantArt, I used to follow them back about four or five years ago. I don't remember this because, of course, this was four or five years ago, so I have no fucking idea. Um, because I have a bad memory, but I think I have an idea of who this is. I don't know, their DeviantArt account seems to not exist anymore, but um, they're asking if I have any advice for somebody who wants to start making music. I don't, but I'll tell you some mistakes I've made. Uh, I think the n biggest one when I was starting out was, um, I used to really want to just fit into the niche of, like, the EDM genre, just, like, with no, nothing added to it. I just wanted to be Skrillex, essentially. <laughs> and I mean, I was 11, and, uh, well, no, I can't say the dubstep was relevant in 2015, but, um, it was for me enough, but, yeah. Um, so, yeah, just don't, like, try to find an original sound, otherwise you're gonna be, like, me from 2015 to early 2016, and that's not usually too good. Um, I mean, it was competent near the end. Um, I mean, with all our Genesis, I made a video about, like, all the, like, that whole era. I may or may not continue that when I actually get my, uh, camera back, or uh, my computer back, once I, or if I even remember. Jacob Beck asks, and I, this is someone I know, I know from middle school, um, face reveal at 150 subs, uh, and to that I say, I don't know if the world's ready for that yet. I'm not even ready for it yet. I'm actually looking at the camera right now, and I am viscerally uncomfortable because of gender dysphoria. Anyway, um, Jessica Ortiz, who, um, I only know how to pronounce the name, not because of, like, intuition saying that it's pronounced Ortiz, but because my dumbass, like, had to look on her channel if there was any pronunciation of her name in any videos, and there was a whole video dedicated to that, so there we go. Uh, she's asking about my pronouns, the she, her. Um, that's, I, I'm not even trying to pass right now, so pardon any peach fuzz or my fucking eyebrows. Uh, uh, your hair looks sick, I love it. I, I, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know how to respond to that. I think that that's cool that you think it's cool, but I think it's um, I think it's just all right. Like I said in the other video, it's just a mohawk, but like different. Uh, how have I been coping with quarantine? Uh, sleep it, and food. Ton, tons of tons of chips. Anyway, um, Heliade, and I don't know if I'm pronouncing that right. This is actually the third take of the video because my phone likes to. Um, Actually, it's just because I've saved so many memes on my phone that I don't, like, have any storage space. I'm gonna, I'm gonna work on that, um, but she's asking when my birthday is, and that would be, uh, November. Uh, Chlorinated Helium, which is probably her second account based off the fact that, um, like, she, the comment mentioned a second account, and I figured it was, uh, Heliade's second account. 
again, please correct me if I'm pronouncing that incorrectly. Um, she says, uh, what's my favorite key in both major and minor? I don't usually think about that kind of stuff. When I'm making music, I, uh, I just make sounds, and if it sounds good, then I keep it. Uh, however, um, I don't have a favorite key in major key. Um, maybe there will be an occasional, like, indie song that, like, is just, like, really, really depressing and edgy and shit, and, uh, since I'm a little bitch, I think that's quite good, um, but I think my, my favorite, um, minor key, at the moment at least, is the one that Tool keeps using in every song, because they seem to have a huge boner for it. Anyway, it goes like... That was The Grudge. Um, I uh, know that song very loosely. Not enough to do a cover, unless you want a really messy cover done by someone who can't um, do it <laughs> at all. But, yep, that is... They have also used it in Undertow and probably like 50 million other songs of theirs. They seem to find have found a niche uh, with that key, and yet it doesn't sound generic at all when they do it over and over again. Um, Maybe it's just because the only songs I listen to from them are in that key. Undertow's a good fucking song, okay? Anyway, yeah, that was the q and I'm gonna stop the video.